Greer's, Sisters, my Chombaholics, and his Derrickins out there. Welcome back to Agree to Disagree. I'm Joe, and I'm here with Derek. Yeah, it's great to be back. Who man. is home from college for the weekend? Yes, I am. And we got a chance to see Captain Phillips. So quickly, before uh, we saw Captain Phillips, what were you expecting? My expectations for this movie were absolutely through the roof, uh, and this movie did not cease to amaze me with that. Uh, the coming attractions built this movie up so great for me, and I was so blown away by this. It was crazy. I agree completely. The selling point was definitely Tom Hanks for me. It looked like he was on top of his game, and it looked like the other actor, the lead pirate, was someone who was going to take me by storm. So I was definitely looking forward primarily for those two reasons. And after seeing Captain Phillips, what do you have to say? Amazing. Um, I want to say it's on the top 10 list of best movies I've seen. It's wow. definitely the best movie I've seen in a while. And what I want to do right now is the last time I was here with you guys, we reviewed The Conjuring. Yep. And we walked out of there and we had chills, yes? Yeah. Walking out of Captain Phillips, I now, I can't stop. I have the chills still. I, <laughs> I can't even explain what just happened. It was amazing. What Derek is bringing up, of course, is the um, the scenes in, they're so scary in this movie. They are very terrifying, and that is because of the directing and the acting. The, the directing by Paul Greengrass, who I was unfamiliar with, I, I haven't seen any of his other movies, but amazing, really, really incredible. And then Tom Hanks was on top of his game in this movie, and the lead pirate was really, really good as well. And we're gonna stop here, because we want to talk about spoilers. So if you have not seen Captain Phillips, please go see it. You don't want to know what happens because the best part of the movie, in my opinion, was not knowing where it's going to go from here. Absolutely. So if you have not seen it, quickly go see it. And hopefully if you're still watching, you've seen Captain Phillips. So we'll give you five seconds to run out five of here. Five more pause seconds. This, pause this video. Five, five four, four, three, three two, two, one. Spoilers. Okay. So this lead pirate's role we haven't seen much of him. I don't know where I've seen him before. Will we see more of him? I think we will. I think we will. He did such a great job uh, talking about the acting and everything. Tom Hanks, definitely one of the best pieces I've ever seen him in. You want to compare Absolutely. this to Philadelphia, of course. Tom, definitely up there on the top of the list. Tom Hanks works. Uh, this lead pirate, uh, one, one uh, line he's been saying throughout the whole movie when he had uh, Captain Phillips captain in the lifeboat, uh, he said, don't you worry, Captain Phillips. Everything going to be okay. And what happens at the end when he gets rescued by the U.S. Navy and the nurse has him on the table? Don't worry, Captain Phillips. Everything is going to be okay. Mind I love that connection. Yeah, it was cool to see the um, progress. Yeah. You know, like how it went through the movie. And each time he said it, it got more terrifying. I, I was scared every time he said it. Because these are real-life situations. Of course, the movie, if you didn't know, was based on a true story of uh, Somalian pirates and piracy. So, you know, Since we're in the spoiler section, I will also bring up when Tom Hanks is rescued. Wow, I I was getting teary eyed. <laughs> it yeah. was very, very, very emotional. I don't know. If, it, it definitely sucked me in the acting. I don't know if it was because of Tom Hanks or because of the writing or just both combined in general. But I was shaking. I got teary eyed. It really hit me. This 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 movie was the best movie I've seen in a while. Tom Hanks is a phenomenal actor. There is no denying that. But if you have lost faith in him because of recent movies, and <laughs> like Cloud Atlas, <laughs> like Cloud Atlas, that, that's one of them. He's fantastic here. I'm reassuring you, he's great. And, and this, one of my favorite roles of his, phenomenal, absolutely phenomenal. Yeah. So let's say on a scale of one to 10, how would you rate this movie, Joe? That's hard. Um, for a movie in its category, this type of movie, I'm gonna give it around a 9.4. 9.4? Yeah, all right. I was thinking 9.5. Uh, just the top thing? Just, just the top thing, Joe. No. <laughs> in my head before I asked, 9.5. Just, uh, I, I don't know what I took 0.5 off for because I don't see anything wrong with it, but I just don't see it as a but 10. It didn't feel perfect. Yeah, it didn't feel perfect, but it was definitely a great movie. Yeah, and it's definitely awesome. So, At least we know we're standing on Queen Street for this review. <laughs> <laughs> All 
All right, guys. So that is our review of Captain Phillips. Let us know what you think, because if you're watching this, you this was spoilers, so you yeah. saw it by now. So let us know what you think. And yeah, like our Facebook page, follow us on Twitter, subscribe, because it takes around that much effort and as much effort to do so. And Derek, it's been an honor. Don't worry, Joe. Everything's going to be okay. Now let's see if we can create this group.